Hey guys, another video here. Um, this one is how to um, run or manage whatever you want to call it. Uh, a bucket server. Now, bucket is the new Heyo mod, if you didn't know. Heyo is completely out of date and it's not working anymore. So, bucket um, is the new Heyo. Uh, so, what bucket allows you to do is it allows you to um, make mods, or well, not make, um, you can make them, but install mods for your server, which allow you to do more things than the average, I mean, than the normal default Minecraft server can do. For example, essentials, which um, which allow you to place warps, um, kits, starter kits. Um, I'll make a video on how to install that and um, world edit. That's these are just a few of them. There's loads. Um, uh, world edit allows you to like just edit your world so basically you can use cuboid if you don't know what that is it's, you can um, place huge amounts of blocks like well s say you wanted to flatten out land you could do it within a click um, so anyway on to the video on how to manage it so I've got I I think it's hand it's a good idea to keep all your bucket bucket stuff in a, in a folder so um, yeah, this is what you'll get when you make a bucket server. Uh, banned players. Uh, I usually, I mean, banned IPs. I I usually don't use that because I'm not entirely sure what that does. But anyway, banned players. What you do is double click and write their name, your banned player, and then close save. But I'm not gonna save because I don't want to ban Asta Matata. ASDF, ASDF, whatever that guy's called, I just wrote <laughs> random. Uh, so I'm going to save. And then craftbucket.jar, that's the Minecraft server.jar equivalent, but just buck, bucket. Um, I'll get onto that in a sec. Um, items, um, that's, um, I think that's for the essentials mod, which this just tells you the number of, which, like, it tells you that wooden stairs is 53, so you're right. Give Sean Grobler to 53 or whatever your name. Uh, ops, so write that. Um, here is where your ops go. Write their names, close, save. Um, ops can do various things like teleport, set warps, um, hack, even though we're not allowed to hack on my server, um, and server log. Uh, well, I, cl I just clean my server log up if you saw in my other, vi other video, but what server log does it, it um, basically shows you everything that's happened on a, on your server, like everything someone's written, everything some every time someone's logged in or out, um, what they've hacked, where they've teleported, all that. Um, and server properties, this is the one I use most. Um, just going to enlarge it and zoom in if I do that. Anyway, here is the last date you um, edited it. And level name, I usually keep it as world because things just get co confusing if you change it because it makes a new world folder and then you'll have to copy and paste the old world stuff into the new world and it just gets confusing. Hell world, I would keep it as false because right now it's broken in um, multiplayer. Spawn monsters, up to you. I'd keep it false. Oh, and if you wanted to make it true, for example, anything, just write true. But I don't want to. I want to keep it false. Uh, online mode, true. Online mode will be default. True. Uh, spawn animals, true. Max players, 20 is default, but it, you can change it. It's up to you. Server IP, that'll be blank. That's normal. Keep it blank. PVP, it's up to you. But I'm going to make it false. Um... So port 25565, just keep it as that, um, default, save, um, and that's basically what it does. And world folder, you won't need to know because I don't understand what the hell this is. It's just folders and folders and folders. Folders within folders within folders of stuff. I don't understand. Um, and plugins, this is where your plugins will be, like extra mods and stuff. Essentials, which allows you to place warps, starter kits and all that. And world edit, which I've already told you about, cuboid and all and stuff like that. So um, yeah, that was just my video on how to 
manage or run bucket server i hope you enjoyed please rate comment and subscribe and stay tuned for the next episode